Hi everyone, it's Jakko here. Today I'm going to show you guys one quick tip on how to use Sculpt this Pro mode. This is one way that we can use this awesome tool in Zebras and how we can get advantage of of these new uh, ways to work here. So I have this uh, model of this um, uh, clothing thing in here and what I've done is just uh, decimated this and then I noticed that I have a some something happened to this and maybe I smoothed it by accident or something something like that so we can actually fix this pretty easily using the sculptors so I'm just gonna act activate this and maybe put this uh, wireframe on so we can see what's happening so I have actually this custom brush in here and and this is one of the brush that I use to create those seams and and if I uh, activate this I'm gonna go take a uh, let's say some value like this and I'm gonna do that you can see that it uh, decimates the mesh to give us more uh, detail but it really doesn't work with uh, custom brushes uh, it works with like um, standard brush or damp standard or clay and so on most of those actually work really well but if you have some custom brushes you just it just doesn't really work but there's a way how we can do this so if we just um, go back in here for example and then I'm gonna uh, hit shift and now we can see that we can activate this Sculptish Pro mode for also for smoothing and this is really awesome so if I'm gonna let's say uh, draw size 2 so the smaller the draw size more uh, geometry we're gonna create so I'm just gonna smooth around here so you can guys see that now we are uh, creating more topology on on these areas here so this is gonna allow us to get in here and add some more details so I'm gonna go like really small something like 1 I'm just gonna brush over here so this is gonna uh, give us a small geometry like so so now we have kind of a added that necessary geometry to support this detail I'm just gonna maybe brush a little bit more here so we can maybe have more space to work on so I'm just gonna disable this and now I'm just gonna deactivate because we don't need this we have already that uh, geometry we need and I'm gonna maybe go like I don't know maybe like six in here so uh, this is just a approximation of course I'm not quite sure what I actually what values I actually use to create I'm just gonna try to brush this to see yeah it, it's a little bit big so I'm gonna um, go like on five so something like that might actually be be good enough it's not like perfect or anything but I think you guys get the idea that that by smoothing using the uh, sculptors pro mode we can uh, create more geometry where we need after we have like decimated so if you have a uh, already decimated uh, your model and you're almost like ready to go and then you know this oh you have a mistake in there you don't need to go back in there and just to do everything from scratch you can just to fix the the geometry what you need by using this fantastic new tool this called this pro mode here in zebra so i hope you guys find something useful out of this so this was Yako. i hope to see you guys soon bye bye